Annyeonghaseyo. I'm Joe Harrington, professor of economics at Johns Hopkins University and the author of Games, Strategies, and Decision Making. To the students of Dr. Sung Kim's class at Iwa Women's University, I warmly welcome you to the fascinating subject of game theory. The history of game theory begins in 1838 with the French mathematician Augustin Cournot and has involved some of the greatest minds of the 20th century, including John von Neumann and John Nash. But in a sense, the history of game theory is much older, because game theory is a mathematical tool for understanding strategic reasoning, and strategic reasoning is as old as man has been a social animal. From a very young age, we strategize every day of our lives. But what we don't often do is to look deeply into that reasoning process, to understand it better, and to come up with better ways to make decisions. That is the objective of this class. Now, if you look at the preface of my, of my game theory book, you notice I acknowledge some of the students who I have taught game theory to in the past. One of these, Manish Gala, has gone on to the Harvard Medical School. And he wrote to me recently the following, quote, despite the attempts of a medical education to crowd out everything that I have learned before, I have tried to keep up with game theory. My senior talk as a resident was about applying game theory principles to dilemmas faced by doctors and healthcare providers." Unquote. Another student, Jonathan Japonis, also wrote to me to tell me that, game theory, that his game theory book was one of the few textbooks he still has on his bookshelf many years later. Uh, these testimonies speak to the never-ending value to an education in game theory. In concluding, let me extend my warm wishes to Dr. Sung Kim, who I fondly remember as a brilliant student at Hopkins. And if at some point in the class, what Dr. Kim says is different from what's in the textbook. I recommend you believe Dr. Kim. Enjoy game theory.